Okay, greetings everyone. Welcome to Gerard Black in the Philippines with the truth. <laughs> Why did you think I would step over the wire? Did it very good. Uh, welcome to my channel, Gerard Black in the Philippines with the truth. I welcome all my subscribers, all my commenters, all my lovers, haters, triggers, peaches, each and every one of you, I welcome to my channel. And those of you who watched my video yesterday, you know, uh, the theme was about family. And it was about how I adopt families along the way as I travel in this life. And one of the beautiful things about being adopted by families is that you get to know the children of those families. And right now, I'm going to introduce you to three children who are not so much of a children these days, have grown up now and on their way to college. And I've known them since they were in high school, junior high school, and watching them grow. I, I, you know, there's one thing about helping the young people uh, that you have to encourage them and support them in whatever way you can. And sometimes just them calling me and say, you know, Uncle Onyx or Tito, uh, can you give me a load or something like this? I am more than happy to do that. Why? Because I know they're doing the right thing. You know, and it's always a good thing when you can uh, actually take credit for supporting someone because what the world needs more than anything else is not only love, but support, especially for the young people. So right now, let me introduce you. Let me introduce yourself. This is... Hi, I'm Kathleen Turner Rodriguez. Hi, my name is Joy. Hello, this Shima. is... Shima! Hi, up. I'm sorry, go ahead. Joy? Yes. Hi, my name is Joy. And this is Haina. Okay, uh, you may recognize these girls. They've been on my videos several times, and every time they come over, you know, I don't hesitate to put them on my channel. Well, you guys just recently graduated. Tell us what's going on, Catherine. What did you just recently do? I I graduated in Metro de Macari College, my course of Diploma in Tourism Technology. Okay. Okay, and what, what are your plans? I'm planning to have a work next month. And but for this month was, I'm just I, I want to rest for a while. Okay, you want to rest that brain, huh? Yeah. You know, I, Mia just explained to me that you know, 11th and 12th grade is considered college. Yeah. You know, which which I didn't know. In the United States, we go you know first grade to 12th grade, and that's high school. And once you finish high school, then you start at college. So it's different. Well. <laughs> I'm sure. No, whoa, whoa. Come on, go, go, get out of here. <laughs> They're gonna knock down the camera. The phone down. Luna. I don't wanna see you. <laughs> I'm gonna come back again. <laughs> Luna, you're scaring me. <laughs> you know. You know, so uh yeah, so it, it, it's a different uh uh school system here than what they do in the Philippines is, and that's at after twelve. When they get to 12, that's already considered two years of college. Yeah. We're all watching them on pins and needles because they're stepping right here over the cord. Um, okay. Um, okay, try it. Celestine, go. Celestine. Yes, yeah, Celestine. Celestine means heavenly body, by the way. Oh. That's the name I gave oh. my daughter, heavenly body. Okay, so uh, Joy, tell us uh, yeah. uh, what's your plans? What are you doing? I'm still studying. I'm okay. not. I'm not third grade. Okay, how many yes. years you have? Uh, I have a year. Uh, one year left. Yeah. And then you know what your plans are? Uh, I'm still thinking. Still thinking. Yeah. Okay. Just like in the U.S., go to college, you still don't know what, it's, what you want to do with your life, okay? And go tell us about you. How about you? You, you finished school? Or yeah, what? I just graduated last, last, last Monday. So uh, my plan is um, I'll be um, applying for uh, a job. Customer service. Yeah, customer. Also, I'm planning to go abroad, so I'm looking for an agency to let me go there. Okay, do you have, have, have you looked at the countries that, that uh, you may no. have considered wanting to go and work in? Yeah, I'd like to go in Canada. Canada? Oh, yeah. Canada. Oh. Why don't you just go to the U.S.? I got, I got Canada, she wants to go to Canada. My God, you can't get any closer to the U.S. than Canada. So uh, tell my viewers what do 
Uh, how old are you, Catherine? You're 25. 21. <laughs> 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 I'm only because I have some Hennessy and I said, You can't drink this until you're 21. She, I'm 21, then I can't be 25. That's why she's going. So you're 21. Yeah. And how about you, Joy? Yeah, I'm 22 now. Okay. And I'll be turning 22 this October. Oh, this October. Okay. Uh, do you have boyfriends or? or no, are, are, are I have girlfriends, sir. Are no, we don't. We don't. We don't, we don't, we don't. No. Oh, okay. Uh, well, uh, um, are you lesbian? I'm bisexual. Okay. Oh, okay. We're bisexual. Oh, oh okay. All of you? No. No, no not okay. me. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, while you know, while they sort that out, that's a beautiful thing. <laughs> you yeah. know what I'm so uh, I'm going to ask you something. This is a question on what I was thinking. Um, I know me being a foreigner. I often think that Filipino girls uh, tend to get pregnant at an early age. Yeah. Uh, um, you are fortunate, you know, uh, to. I've gone through school, high school, over 21, 21, and not have children. Just looking back, without mentioning names, how many of your girlfriends do you know who have children who are around your same age? I think I five, 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 five three. Yeah, more than five, I more think. More than five? Yeah. Wow, wow. Mm -hmm. I, I always wondered about that. I thought I thought that was one of the uh, uh, pets, uh, you know, uh, passage to becoming a woman that you have to have a child by 20 but i guess that's not true huh mm -hmm. uh, do, do either one of you plan to have children or no, want to have not children yet or not yet two? i think um 25 but i'm still already 25 years old 20, 20. you're gonna have a one wondrous life i, I always tell that I, I was a little bit young filipinas to say you're gonna have a good life you're going to have an interesting life. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know? yeah. And oh, okay. Catherine's going to be Catherine. <laughs> okay, so uh, so tell us what um, some of the things you guys do, what type of activity you do as uh, young Filipino girls. Tell my viewers, well, first of all, are, are you looking for foreigners or partners or anything like that? Well, you're looking, huh? for, you're looking for a foreigner. Yeah. Yeah. She's looking well, for a foreigner. She's looking for a foreigner. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. a good a good one. Tell yeah. it. I know. I know. It's Catherine was, was, was coming up. I always told her, "Don't get pregnant." You know what I'm saying? So I always kind of put that in the head. Yeah. You know, you know, not not to do that. And so, but you're looking for a foreign, huh? Wow, yeah. Canada. Canadian. <laughs> no. Canadian. Yeah. Canadian. Yeah. Russian. Russian. She likes I'm Russian. Looking for she likes Russian. Russian. Yeah. Russian. Oh, okay, okay, okay. 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 So, you, so you hear that? Those of you who are Canadian or Russian. Cafe is available. You can pick me up in the comments <laughs> section, and I'm sure at the end of this, she's going to uh, give you her, her uh, Facebook address. Okay, uh, is, is there something that that you would like to say? You know, uh, to tell the people uh, about the Philippines. You know, why why should they come to visit the Philippines? Because give us your best commercial for the Philippines. You Catherine. should come because it's more fun in the Philippines. <laughs> They should come because the people here are hospitable. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And kind. Okay. They okay. should come here because I'm here. Okay, before I let you go, let me say I, I, I'm honored that you guys still remember me to, come, to come visit me and, and, and ask me. Yeah, you know, she uh Catherine asked me uh uh uh, Tito, can we come visit you and see Duchess? I said, well, you have to talk to Mia. Mia. So so she contacted Mia, and then Mia told me that Catherine wants to come over, and I, Mia put it back in my lap. So I said, okay, go, good. You know, because it's one thing about my, you know, inviting people to come over at any given time, but it's, it's something else when I include my wife in that yeah. decision. So it was important to me that, that Catherine, who I've known for a long time, and known Mia, too, for a few years, too, that it's important that that whatever is involved with me that she goes through my wife because this way it makes every it, it makes a happy home okay <laughs> okay with that being said what advice would you give someone about following your dreams and your goals Catherine what <laughs> <laughs> what advice what advice would you give what advice yeah about following your dream and your goal just focus on your goals okay. and Listen to your uncle. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Because okay. okay. you're hard. Uh, for me, don't rush things. Um, time will come and 
tables for a turn. Right. Mm-hmm. For me, be confident, then don't be scared to make mistakes because you've learned from it. Okay. Your words. Google oh, yeah. it. <laughs> okay, so before before we go, you want to give us your Facebook? So this way they can, uh, a Russian guy can find Catherine. Um, my Facebook account was Catherine Sarno Rodriguez and Telegram Miss Park 029 and TikTok. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Say that again slowly. What is it? Telegram at Miss Park. Telegram. Yeah. What's Telegram? It's, it's like uh, Messenger. It's an app. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Okay, the young people know what it is. Yeah. But Telegram. Small what? letter Miss Park 09. Miss Park. 29. Okay. And no space and and no Instagram <laughs> and Instagram at Miss Park. That's all. And uh, P A R K, right? Yeah. Okay. And for me, it's it's Joy de la Cruz. Yeah. Joy what? De la Cruz. Yeah, spell on de la Cruz. D E L A C R U Z. De la Cruz. Okay. okay. And you can follow me at my Facebook. Fer Heinegli Ferrater. Ferrater. <laughs> spell it. It's H Y N A F E R R A T E R. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm jumping up because the dog is going by. Okay. So thank you for watching Dry Black in the Philippines with the truth. Remember, dreams are nothing more than plans awaiting action. Never disrespect L. They always pull someone up. And sometimes, sometimes you're the only one to see your vision. The only one to see your vision. And the best revenge in life is to live. Are we living good today, girls? Yes. yes. And we hope you are too. If you're lucky enough to have a good man, uh, uh, if you're lucky enough to have a, uh, a woman like Ali Woodson, formerly singing the Temptation One song, treat her like a lady. And ladies, if you're lucky enough to have a good man like me, make him feel like a king and never say no. Okay, can we throw him a kiss? Yeah. Mwah. See ya. Hi. Hi, my name is Catherine. And I am Joy. And this is Heinz. Thank, Thank you for watching the Rye Black in the Philippines with the truth. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and, and ring, ring the, the bell. bell. We, we are single. single.